I am doing my personal quote and blog for the 23rd of June 2022. Okay, my quote today. We all have a black cat inside, one that requests our attention and refuses to hide. We are that cat and within our heart, she is the beginning of each day from the start. If we could learn to awaken and purr as we shift from slumber and start to stir, we could rise as the sun just begins to glow on the horizon as we stretch to say hello. Morning is the most quiet of times. It is there, it is where mo that moment where oftentimes I listen deeply to my own thoughts while most of the world dreams of what nots. As the light brightens the day, what yesterday felt like dismay fades in the bluish and cooling light into the hopefulness for the human plight. Each day our hope is renewed. I know the majority of humanity is not so hatefully crude, but in this moment too many are afraid because democracy has too far strayed off the path of truth and equality and into a space where leaders are a heinous frivolity. Such things are very bad indeed because when a country abandons its own creed, that is when a breakdown begins and the people end up answering for their demented sins. And my blog for today. The gray and white stone from ancient times calls to me as I try to recline. In my meditation, I am sitting on a mountaintop, one that is familiar in the perfect viewing spot. I like to overlook the valleys that climb up into the sky. I love to watch the rainbows passing by. With the wind as the night turns into day, I love to see beyond the horror of a world gone astray. Within the cycles of natural time, we continue to exist even in wartime. Life goes on and the cycles remain. Cougars still hunt and birds try to attain. In my heart, I have the courage to care. It takes a powerful heart to lay the truth bare. We cannot thrive in a world without knowing. We cannot arrive without going. Work today to see from the overview. Stand on the mountaintop and remember what is true. Don't believe that hate will win. Don't let others that hold such deadly sin to make the choices that will destroy the good and remember to protect and defend what you should. Thanks everyone.